Greetings brothers and sisters in Christ. Welcome to the channel. Welcome back to the channel. It is always good to be here with you. It is always good to have you here with me. Sorry for the voice. I'm a bit under the weather, but the show must go on. Today we'll be talking about Richie, the clown barber slash pastor. Celebrity barber who tattooed his entire face to look like a permanent clone reveals he is now studying to be a pastor, despite admitting kids are terrified at his appearance. Joy Tellers, a California pastor, shares pulpit with clown barber, says his testimony impacting young people for Christ. Richie the Barber, whose real name is Richie Esposito, is ready to jump into pastoral ministry after professing faith in Jesus Christ following a number of podcast appearances in which the 38-year-old barber shared his newfound faith. Now, Richie announced that he is studying to become a pastor with a little help from Pastor Joey Tellers. Now, Richie stated, quote, I'm studying to become a pastor. I finally got my first book. Pastor Joey is helping me study for my tests. It's going to take a year, but I'm dedicated to this in Jesus' name. End quote. In his testimony, he shared he once did drugs and parted with satanic celebrities. He always knew God, but always said, I'll be there later. After getting sober, Richie said he finally gave his life to Christ after a broken relationship. He also said, I came home and I started to believe and the Holy Spirit just entered. He said, Pastor Tellers said the biggest miracle is ultimately salvation. And what I've seen in Richie's ministry is that people are getting set free and it's such a beautiful thing. Pastor Tellers say they connected on social media. And shortly after that, Richie was baptized and was starting a Christian punk band and offered a spot to Tellers to play drums. We just hit it off playing music initially, said Tellers. And then I just started to speak into his life. Since then, he has opened up his pulpit to Richie multiple times. I wanted him to share what God has done because ultimately, it's just been an incredible testimony for what the Lord continues to do in his life, he said. When asked whether the clone set up is a potential stumbling block for the gospel, Teller said that's not how he sees it. In fact, Teller said he believes Richie is an answered prior. Teller said he specifically remembers praying in his backyard for the Lord to bring people into his life whom nobody would expect God to use. No. <laughs> now let us take a look at Richie. The clown slash barber slash pastor. <laughs> Now, with that being said, let's listen to the word of God preached by the man, Apostle Pastor Gina Jennings. No. Give me that believe the book of Jeremiah. Jeremiah 23 and verse 1. Let me show you what Jeremiah said and what Jeremiah said, how he didn't haste to stop being. That's right. Listen. Woe be unto the pastors that destroy and, and scatter the sheep now, of my pastors. Here you had the prophet Jeremiah was reprimanding shepherds mm -hmm. that was scattering God people. And that's what you've been having back then, and that's what you have now. That's right. Men that are scattering God people. Yes. What do you mean they're scattering? Here you got people being taught the truth, and then you get a devil rise up right among the people. Right. You can't 
jump up out of your bedroom yelling, That's God right. calling, singing, and preaching the gospel. No, Lord. You got to have an apostle. That's right. Lay hands on you. That's right. And then send you out. Amen. Amen. Got to have one. Any man Go ahead, declare bro. himself to be called and sent direct from God. Amen. Who's a liar. That's a lie. That's right. Hear me? That's right. I said any of you. Any of them. I don't care who your pastor any is, of them. who he was, where he come from, how old, ahead, how young, how small, how great. That's right, man. You are a liar. That's right. You got to come like in here. That's right. And they was ordained, ordained. by an apostle. Right. Amen. That's right. I don't care how much scriptures you quote that you claim God revealed this and revealed that. I don't believe nothing That's right. outside That's it. of that book. That's it. There's not a new thing under the sun. Amen. God will not act today what he did not do yes. yesterday. That's right. That's why I encourage the viewers. Go ahead, bro. Don't take nobody's word. Go to the book. Go to the book. Watch the truth of God. That's right. And you will learn yes, you will. God's eternal word. That's right. And then when you go in your church, now you can look mm -hmm. with understanding. Amen. You can listen yes. with understanding. That's right. You'll find yourself not getting that excited no more. That's right. You're listening, watching, yes. observing. That's right. Yes, sir. It's wonderful, brother. My God, we want to get the folk into the kingdom of God. That's it. Huh? That's it. And then they all say, we're the church. We're the church. Of Jesus Christ. My God. Christ is not divided. No, no. Christ is not divided. No. Let me tell you, preaching something. This is a warning to you. Mm -hmm. Everything that's following you. Mm -hmm. If it's three people. When one dies, one dies. you got to give an account to God for the information that was in their gut. That's right. When they depart this life. That's right. Remember, That's God right. going to judge you mm -hmm. by what you teach him. And now, O ye priests. Do you hear this? In Malachi chapter 2 and at verse 1. Let's close out on this. And now, O ye priests. O ye priests. This commandment is for you. This commandment is for you, if, preacher. If ye will not hear. Do you hear it? Self-righteous, arrogant, high-minded, apostolic thing. If you will not hear. If you don't hear, go here with your bad self. That's right. If you will not hear. And if you will not lay it to heart. And you won't lay it to heart. To give glory unto my name. I had one man write me and say, Pastor Jennings, you don't want to fellowship with no one. That's not the truth. No. I want to no. fellowship with what's right. That's it. That's right. What's right and what's right only. That's right. Otherwise than that, we got thousands we can fellowship with. <laughs> That's right. Thousands. Amen. Remember, mm -hmm. we don't have to go against the word of God to fellowship with nobody. That's right. Listen. If you will not hear. If we don't hear. And if you will not lay it to heart. To give glory unto my name, saith the Lord of hosts. What is it? I will even send a curse upon you. And who he's talking to? O ye priests. This commandment is for you. It's for who? For you. What did he say? I will even send a curse upon I you. I send a curse upon you. And I will curse your blessings. I will curse your blessings. Yeah, I have cursed I've them cursed already. How quick? Already. How quick? Already. Be Why? Because you do not lay it to heart. You won't lay it to heart. That's right. That's why you find yourself preaching for 10, 20, and 30 years and not making no progress. That's right. You're cursed. 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 You ignore the word of God. May God bless you. May God open your understanding, viewer. Thank you for listening. Now, there you have it. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. Until next time, peace be.